according to National Highway Traffic Safety Administration 2023, about 13,500 people die each year due to DUI accidents in the United States alone. That means 37 people die each day due to substance-related accidents. This issue is unacceptable, and it's ridiculous that even today with the increased access to transportation that this issue is still at large. <clears throat> We need to raise awareness on the issue and raise educational requirements in order to alleviate this issue to end so much pain and suffering. DUI accidents are an ongoing problem in the U.S. and awareness needs to be spread in order to end this problem and end the suffering of countless people. According to National Highway National Library of Medicine 2021, 30% of motor vehicle tr traffic fatalities are caused by alcohol impaired driving. It is unacceptable that even today, with all the laws and regulations this country has put in place, that driving under the influence makes up for 30% of fatal crashes. It's obvious that not everyone knows the facts and that some people don't care about the facts. This is a big reason why this problem is still at large. We need to spread awareness and educate our nation about not only the dangers, but the preventive measures that need to be taken in order to reduce this issue and compensate for the carelessness of the people who knowingly drive under the influence. I will first talk about how this problem affects society. Secondly, I'm going to talk about the preventive measures that we can take as a society in order to lessen this issue. And lastly, I'm going to talk about the preventive measures you can take on site to prevent a DUI. It's critical that you know how this problem affects society. The pain and suffering that comes from this issue. The family and friends of DUI victims have to live in pain. This does not only impact the offender, this does not only impact the victim, but the offender will also have to live in extreme guilt for life. How much does, how much it costs the United States? According to the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration 2023, impaired driving crashes cost the United States $68.9 billion each year. This money, could, <clears throat> this money could have been spent in bettering the, our society and improving our country instead it isn't spent on fighting this issue. All right. Now we're gonna talk about how we can reduce DUIs. We need to change the way people look at this problem. People need to be informed of the dangers and consequences of, the, of driving under the influence. You need to inform the people around you of the dangers and consequences. Consequences include license revocation and a fine of up to $10,000, according to Alcohol's Effects on Health 2023. Law Link 2023, according to Law Link 2023, the average drunk driving settlement ranges from $50,000 to $100,000. Even though, even though DUI is not committed in conscious mind, it is treated as a serious offense and can lead to up to four years in prison. We need to take more legislative action to control this issue. There should be more educational requirements. There should be more educational requirements that go into reducing DUIs. According to the president of Mothers Against Drunk Driving, Penny Wagner states that once you've drank your first drink, you've lost your ability to make sound judgment. Let's get into the preventive measures you can take to stop someone from driving under the influence. You should know about the different 
ways to prevent DUI and when to use them. How you can prevent a DUI from happening. Always have a designated driver. Call an Uber for someone who has no way to get home. And intervene with someone who tries to drive home under the influence. You can verbally intervene. And if that doesn't work, you can physically intervene. For example, taking someone's keys away. As we have well established, driving under the influence is something that should never be taken lightly. With the countless people who drive under the influence each day, the chances are you will have many chances in the future to stop a DUI, DUI from happening and possibly save someone's life. Carry the weight of this knowledge as Carry the weight of this knowledge as not only as a call to action. And together, our collective efforts will help greatly reduce this problem. Thank you.